How is it going today, my friends? As always, I hope you all are having yourselves a fantastic day. As you can tell by the title of the video, today I'm going to be showing you how to play Black Ops 2 Free For All. You may not believe me, but this is the third time that I've made this exact video because every year, rather than just link people back to the old video, it's honestly easier just to make a new one. First things first, make sure to leave a like on the video to show your support. You know I would appreciate that very much. Second thing you need to do is find a class that you like. Now, tomorrow's video isn't going to be a part two to this video but since I'm showing you how to play Black Ops 2 free-for-all today tomorrow I'm showing you how to snipe on Black Ops 2 free-for-all and how to snipe in general and how to trick shot a how to trick shot and how to snipe video those are some of the most highly requested videos from you guys the fans you guys are always asking me how I trick shot how I snipe tomorrow's video is exactly that me telling you everything I can and then obviously today's video showing you how you should play on Black Ops 2 okay so how to play Black Ops 2 Free For All. Now, I want to tell you right now, I'm going to say the word here at least 100 times in this video because I'm going to show you a whole bunch of different spots that you need to go. It, that is the most important thing going to these spots, being in the center of the map, controlling the spawns, not controlling one spawn, all the spawns. That is free for all. That is how I get to last so fast. And that is how I hit sniper clips. With that being said, you need to be on at least 10 sensitivity. In my opinion, I play on 12 to snipe to last. You need to constantly be moving. Like if you're looking at one spot for five seconds, you're going to get shot from the back or shot from the side. Most likely you need to constantly be looking. If someone's not there you look in a different spot you're just constantly moving in a circle your head is literally on a swivel at all times in free for all 5 26 27 every single map pack map is in free for all but fucking drone turbine overflow and aftermath can't be okay so 27 maps in free for all think about that and you only play three probably i play all 27 so what i'm gonna do for you guys i'll start with carrier raid standoff and studio and then for anyone who wants to hit clips on more than four maps i highly recommend doing that not only do you hit more clips when you play on more maps then you're not stuck playing fucking studio all day playing against people who sit behind the goddamn wagon okay so we'll start with carry okay so on most maps there is at least two to three spots that you can sit and get to last in a timely manner now on carry this is what a lot of people do they sit behind this barrel right here which isn't bad you can look over there you can look over here but what they always do is they come over here and they kill this spawn right here because you can literally watch someone spawn right there instead of that what I do I sit right here because then I can see the carrier planes I can see this part of the middle of the map I can also see them right there I can see them coming up here I can kill them right when they spawn off of there and I can kill them when they're running around there because there's a spawn in this building and there's a spawn at the bottom of there and sometimes they spawn down there too and obviously they spawn over there as well so this is what I found to be the single best spot because you can look everywhere now if you find yourself spawning on this side of the map which happens to me all the time i'll spawn here over and over and over again now this side of the map nowhere near as good as that side but right here you can look at people who spawn and start running towards the carrier planes or people in the middle of the map there's a spawn directly behind these you can kill them when they run on this side or that side there's a spawn directly behind the helicopter you can kill them over there there's also a spawn over here and over there if you find yourself spawning over here and you don't want to run all the way across the map you can get a lot of kills in this location and those are the two good spots on carrier as as I said earlier, something that a lot of people do, they just watch one spawn. Now what you need to do is you can watch that one spawn that you like to watch, but you need to also go in the middle of the map, then just casually go over to that one sometimes if no one's coming to you. Now Raid's got three really good spots. I'm sure you already know one of the good spots to camp is in here. You can watch people coming up the window and then there's two spawns outside this doorway, one back there and one back in that corner. So if you sit right here, you can literally kill both of them. But what you need to do is be sitting like right here so you can kill them right there, kill them right there kill the dude right there kill the dude right there kill the dude over here fucking turn back around and kill another dude you just need to be fucking in the middle of the map beasting on kids and that brings you to the next location you can also camp here you can watch there there boom get a collapse there collapse there oh and then you walk down here you can see him spawn bop sometimes they come over there so watch your back and that brings you over to this spot of course you just gotta watch there 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 and then you can literally watch a dude spawn right there sometimes they come over through this van doorway so you gotta watch there and then sometimes they come up that staircase because they spawn in the back over by that lambo and instead of coming through this doorway they go around blah blah when you're right here they can come from that left side they can come from the middle and yeah you just got to keep your head on a swivel constantly be looking at all of the locations and constantly be quick scoping bitches which if you don't know how to do remember how to snipe is coming 
coming out tomorrow. All right, so standoff is lit, baby. My best sniper clip in free for all ever is on standoff. And I hit it right around this area. I just kind of went on a fucking tear all through this fucking spot. A fucking, 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 fucking. The spot I mainly like to camp is behind this truck right here because I can watch them coming from that spawn back there, coming from that spawn in there, climbing over the wall and whatnot. Then you obviously can just watch, you can literally watch them spawn right there. Not obviously, but it's obvious to me. You can just watch them spawn right there. And then you come over here and sometimes they spawn right there in that corner. And then you come through behind this nice wall. This wall is very nice because they can't see you. You come over here, kill a bitch, kill a bitch. Keep killing bitches all in this fucking spot. This is the area you want to be killing it in. You gotta be watching spawns and spinning. Now if you find yourself over here and you don't feel like walking over there or there's a lot of people over here, kill a bitch over there. Sometimes they spawn over there. They 100% spawn in there. Sometimes they might spawn in that back corner, come and try to sneak up on you. But you can just kind of come in this area. Oh, sometimes they spawn back there and you can kill them. Just boom, bang. Bing, bing, bang. Trying to make it quick. So just realize I'm going to show you a spot and you need to just assume to be looking fucking everywhere from said spot. You can't even consider this camping. It's literally manipulating the spawns and just being a beast at free for all. Camping is like sitting up in a building with claymore shock charges, that kind of shit, and not moving. I'm I'm never not moving unless I'm scoping in to quick scope your bitch ass. You all are already pretty good at studio, but I'm still going to tell you the spawns because I'm a nice guy and for the next week I probably won't be able to get to laugh. As you can see, I spawned right here. Sometimes somebody will will literally spawn right here even if you're standing right here or around this corner so definitely watch that one then obviously someone spawns in the tunnel there's a spawn right fucking here don't stand behind this wagon period end of statement that's the thing the first how to play black ops 2 free for alls i told you guys to sit behind the wagon not anymore we're past that sit in the middle right here and you're constantly moving because there's spawn right there spawn in there as well just spawn back over this stuff so you know they'll be coming through there right in that doorway and you'll be watching the tunnel you just got to constantly be moving right here in this area you know not watching just one spawn watching all the spawn. If you find yourself spawning on this side, which I do very often, this is where I like to sit. There's a spawn right on the other side of those trees, so I come over here sometimes, quick scope the bitch, or I'm over here, they'll spawn, quick scope the bitch. There's also a spawn in here in the castle, so you gotta watch out for them coming out of there. There's a spawn back here in the bathroom, so watch them coming from the inside or the outside. And then there's a spawn on the other side of this wall. So you just gotta move around in circles in this location and constantly be looking. See, that's the thing. I'm literally just constantly moving like this when I'm playing free for all. Boom. Shaka lock. Okay, so those are the only four maps you guys care about. Thank you all so much for watching the video. <laughs> I know some people are going to care about these maps, but to be 100% honest, the only time you're going to be playing Frost, Pod, Downhill, I literally play these maps every single day. Just think about that. The only time you're going to find yourself actually staying on those maps is probably if you get in a game with me or someone else you really want to stay in a game with, like a red member or something among those lines. But on the off chance that you do get in a game on Downhill and Stay or Cargo, I can say without a doubt, if you watch the rest of this video and learn all of the spots that I sit in, it will help you. It will help you get to last so much faster. Why? Because I get to last faster than you do. I honestly love sniping on cargo. I still haven't hit an insane sniper clip, but I don't want to talk about that. I really like cargo because you're up in this spot. That gives you a huge advantage when you're above people and they have to look up and they have to be looking down at people on the same level as them. So this is the spot you need to camp. You'll literally be looking at people right here. Sometimes you'll see two people bowing out. Look over there kill a guy there's a spawn back there look there watch that window as well then come back here sometimes and just constantly be spinning basically i love that spot but sometimes you find yourself spawning over here and you can do the exact same thing on the other side but you know it's not going to be as fast paced so you know as soon as you get a few kills over here just go on and mosey on over to the good spot like i or you can stay over there you know hit a quad feed from that side maybe you're cool enough i'm not the only bitch is the load up time for the games it takes a good amount of time to load up and for it to end it's honestly the majority of the time me just sitting here doing fucking nothing you know i wish i could show you how to play free for all on drone but the fucking map isn't in free for all so you know express time all right express is one of the maps with three good spots if you find yourself in this building right here it can be a pretty good spot sometimes not all the time i find myself jumping out of the window and going fuck this stupid spot so don't sit here all the fucking time you can watch people up on those staircases up on that window some people will spawn in there run on the ground same thing for this side because this map is so fucking symmetrical. That's a good little spot, and I found myself getting some very nice streaks in there. If you ever have a VSAT and you're in that building, oh, it's knuck and futz. Now, we are over at this side. There is a spawn right there near that yellow pole. Sometimes they come in through there. There's a spawn right there, so if you find yourself coming up in here for a little bit, sometimes they can spawn right there. Then there's spawns over in that building, so you gotta watch that, and you gotta watch that window, and you can watch that and the train. Always be watching people coming out of this tunnel and over in this area, because those are the frequent spawns, and you 
you just gotta constantly be moving and looking at them now the other side is the exact same because as i said this map is symmetrical still walk over there for five seconds for kicks and giggles spawn right there still spawn right over by that yellow thing as well constantly be looking at this tunnel constantly look just like you would on the other side show me the next one all right now it is time for hijacked hijacked is lit i've gotten a lot of really sick sniper streaks and sniper clips on hijacked a lot of good sniper streaks from this spot right here you can watch people spawn on the other side of this wall people coming up there there's a spawn right on the other side of this down the stairs so you got to kind of watch for them just in case they come up from behind but most of the time they'll just run straight forward you can kill them there there's a spawn right there you know what to do you just sit in this location look around same thing goes for this spot right here because this is a really good central spot and then right over here on this side i do the same thing and then sometimes i find myself sitting in here you know it honestly just depends on the lobby that's the thing about hijack this whole fucking central area is just a good spot to run around and dominate spawn right over there spawn is right there as well there's also a spawn way back there so you just got to find yourself constantly running back and forth looking for people spawn right back over there boom 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 Boom. Hijack. Meltdown. I, I know you've never even fucking played Meltdown, but this map is awesome for sniping, so you're missing out. Look at this central area. It is raised, and you can see the whole fucking map. You can see probably two to three people over in this area at all times. Someone will be coming up this staircase. Someone will be coming from the left. People go up in the window. Sometimes they come through here, but not very often. Window. Same thing on the other side over here. There's constantly people. If you get into this middle area and your accuracy is on, you're fucking some shit up. You can also camp behind that truck and over on that side but nothing is more effective than sitting over here in the middle on meltdown holy fucking shit i just realized that i still have to do all of these man all right i don't have to do nuketown y'all are fine on nuketown right stop fucking staring at him carl and get to it or else it's not gonna be done next map is plaza i know you probably didn't even know that plaza existed because you back out so fast every time you see it but it's also a really good map for sniping and you can actually hit some bill cams i've hit some bill cams on it. it's a really good spot to camp you can watch the middle of the map there's always people running in the middle of the map and then there's always people climbing up that ladder so you can literally just sit here pop 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 Pop, 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 bitch down there too. After you're done popping all those bitches, you come over here into the middle, and this spot is just like the meltdown spot. Raised, you can see everything. People can come from the left side and the right side of this building right here, so you just gotta watch this doorway, watch that, watch that, watch the up top right there, watch in here, someone's always coming through in here. Then watch this side as well. Then you can go up top. You can go up top right there and do the same thing you did on this side. It's symmetrical, so it's literally the same exact thing, just opposite. It's symmetrical, so it's literally the same exact thing, just on the other side of the map. And yeah, like I said, Plaza is actually really good. If you haven't played it, you should. I get a lot of clip opportunities on this map. Yeah, I know, slums. You don't fucking play this either. But if you spawn over here, people come through this way, back here. And they're all the way over here. That spot's not very good, but I've still gotten some good clip opportunities there. If you find yourself in the middle of the map, it is pretty lit. But this right here is the greatest spot because you can watch someone spawn there. Sometimes someone spawns in there. You watch there. Come in the middle. Boom, 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 pow. Get a lot of really good sniper streaks, but I still haven't hit a really nice sniper clip because it's fucking slum. And I miss when it's important, so, you know, that's my fault. You know, I'd love to show you how to play Turbine on Free For All, but the people who made this game are fucking idiots. That is literally the best trick shotting map on Black Ops 2, no doubt about it. And it's not in fucking Free For All. That's just so stupid. Honestly, I'd tell you to camp on this side of the map, but it's pretty shit. But if you do find yourself over here streaking, this is a good spot to camp and just, you know, go all out. I find my myself spawning on the other side of the map all the time so it's really hard but when i get right here oh my god this is such a good spot you can watch a spawn there you can watch someone come around there sometimes they come up through there someone's always spawning in that building and coming through here sometimes they'll spawn right fucking here but this spot right here oh my god it's so hectic but it's so good if your accuracy is on point i really like yemen but it's no turbine like why does that get to be in free for all but not not my baby we made it guys we made it to the dlc oh my god the list is even bigger you guys really need to know how to play nuketown i don't even want to tell you how to play nuketown i have enough fucking trouble with the way you guys play it if i tell you how i play it that's just gonna piss me off yeah we'll leave that one out go to the middle of the map on nuketown fucking put your head on a swivel downhill oh jesus fucking christ pretty sure i'm the only one who ever plays this map and the people who get stuck with it in my lobby too the poor souls okay so downhill another fun map for sniping i like sitting in this area you can watch the entire middle of the map there's a spawn someone will always be coming through here there's a spawn back here literally right there so you'll see them sometimes someone runs through there this is a pretty fast-paced sniping spot 
If you find yourself on the other side of the map, you can also sit right here and do the same thing you're doing on that side, just watching the middle of the map right there and watching right here. And then if you find yourself spawning all the way the fuck over here, this is a really good spot to camp sometimes. People spawn behind there. There's literally a spawn right fucking there. So you can just sit here, literally shoot them. Bang, bang, boom. I've gotten very, very big sniper streaks from this hill right here and on downhill, but I still haven't hit a fucking decent trick shot on this map, and that is why I hate it. Honestly, wouldn't hate it if I would have hit any of the shots that I want to hit on it, but it's a piece of shit until that happened. Alright, what's next? Mirage. I love me some Mirage. If you guys see Mirage on the next, if you see this map Mirage up for vote next, instead of not voting Mirage and going to random getting downhill and then backing out of the lobby, vote Mirage. This map kicks ass. This spot right here Oh, so many sniper streaks. Sometimes they come from the back right here. They spawn right here, and then they climb over this wall right here as well. And they spawn back there, so watch there. And then they spawn back there, so watch there. And then there's also a spawn right here, so you just keep fucking walking, looking around, constantly moving back and forth, quick skipping some bitches. Now on this side, I find myself sitting right here a lot of the times and up top, but right here, I will watch that doorway back there you gotta watch back there as well when spawns there they'll walk out that door where you gotta watch that and then you gotta watch up top and you gotta kind of watch the middle that's a pretty good spot but nothing beats up top because you can also watch over here get one or two kills here kill the guy who spawned there kill the guy there bang bang this is just the up top spot because oh he ran out of ammo just chill here for a second bing bang boom you're back in the action i love this spot get a lot of streaks up here and i've hit a lot of really nice shots on mirage this is one of my favorite trick shotting maps in free for all because you know we don't get to have fucking turbo so I'm never gonna forget that if I ever meet Von Har, I'm gonna ask him why it wasn't in free for all. I swear to God. Hi. Oh, yeah. oh. Just looking at these maps is boring. I know why you guys don't want to play maps like Hydro. It's totally understandable. But I play Hydro because when we get the map Hydro from random or something like that, if I leave, it's going to make a whole bunch of people who watch my videos upset. So, you know, I got to play fucking Hydro. Maybe if Turbine and Drone were in free for all, you know, then it wouldn't be as bad. Uh, hydro can be extremely fast paced and extremely good if you get an orbital V-set. Just sit right here. Literally a spawn right there. They'll sit right behind that head glitch as they always do. Spawn right there. So you just got to watch there. Say you go right here. Sometimes someone will spawn right on the other side of that forklift so just constantly be looking in these two locations you can move around a little bit more if you want but i literally sit right here and they just literally can't kill you literally literally fucking fucking literally this here is one of the most repetitive videos of all time i know that but i'm just trying to show you guys how to play black ops 2 free for all better so when you get in my game you might be able to compete nah, i'm just josh and i'm just trying to help now instead of camping right here which is kind of like you were on the other side this is where you should go because there's a spawn right there and even if you're standing there they'll still spawn there it's really fucking annoying so you want to sit right here Watch this area, there's a spawn right over here, so bam, 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 bam. I know, I know. Just the side of grind. It's so boring. If you ever find yourself playing, it can be very fast paced. Watch that. Watch in here. Watch that door and this side. This side's pretty good, but it's not as good as the other side. I still find myself going on some pretty nice streaks on that side. But over here, there's just more spawns, so if you're sitting here, you can watch over there, you can watch over there. Sometimes they spawn back there, there's a spawn right there. They're just really fast spawns. You know, you can sit here. This whole, like, general area, like, right here is a really good spot to camp because you can watch that and you can watch this and you have like all of these uh, ramps to guard you. This is a really good spot if you're trying to streak it, get a fucking V-set. But if you're trying to kill it, get a quad feed, you know, come on over here into the middle, you can shoot someone over there, spawn them right there, bam, 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 bam. You're not gonna play fucking grind, so it doesn't matter though. Encore! Okay, so for Encore, you can just sit right here, there's a spawn right fucking there, there's a spawn right fucking there, you can literally just watch them spawn, kill them both. Then there's a spawn up top on that staircase, so you just sit in this area, look around in all the areas, areas constantly as you do in all the other fucking spots then the spot for the other side is right over here you know exactly what to do just watch all of the doorways especially this one and this one there is a spawn right back here so if you find yourself over here they can spawn back there what i actually do is i run on this bush and i literally just go around looking at all of the locations and this is what i do because people don't fucking expect you to be standing on top of a bush but now you're going to be expecting me to just be standing on top of a bush because i just told you i stand there don't expect me to be standing there now i'm not going to stand on the bush when i play this map or am i only saying that so that you don't look there we're almost halfway there yeah magma believe it or not i've gotten close to hitting some six sniper clips from this exact spot watch somebody spawn and come around that corner sometimes they'll come through that doorway spawn back there spawn back around this building so you literally just gotta sit in this area and constantly be watching casually watch the middle sometimes as well that's the best spot on this map in my opinion but over on the other side you can go on some pretty nice streaks as well i only find myself camping right behind here 
watching up there spawn there's a spawn right back there so i watched that and i just find myself running in circles just kind of going back and forth from the two of these just looking back and forth if you're still watching the video leave a like you're the real fucking mvp and i know you probably already left a like the off chance that you didn't and you want to prove how awesome you are boom the like button is just the way to do that you click it and instantly you receive a letter of awesome in the mail try it out please note that the letters may take five to six years to come in the mail just enough time for you to forget that i said that vertigo is a fucking lit this is such a good map you stand right here you watch someone spawn there sometimes they'll be coming around this corner but you can literally watch them spawn there watch them coming through this doorway to the guy there there's a spawn right there constantly run back and forth constantly look at these locations and the spawns you're gonna find yourself spawning on this side sometimes now this side has a nice little two-part you can camp right here watch people coming through this doorway come over here someone will spawn right there and then you watch up there or you can come down in here sometimes someone spawns here so watch out there's a spawn right here so you want to watch them come right here and then there's also also spawn right here and when you sit right here you can just see people spawn here watch over here and definitely watch right here on this doorway you just sit here look at it this is a really good spot and vertigo is one of the best free-for-all maps sniping and trick shotting wise one of the ones with the low death barriers you can actually go for more than a 720 here uplink is another great map for sniping and for trick shotting right here is a really good central area you can watch people spawn coming through that doorway kill them coming up through here but the most op spot is right here because you can watch there and then you can watch the spawn there or there and you can come in here reload sit back relax get some fucking kills while you're sitting in the nice comfort building now I spawn on this side of the map a lot and I sit behind this forklift right here sometimes they spawn and run through the back right there come around that corner they definitely spawn in this building so you want to watch that doorway and then you want to also watch inside this building and this hallway so you're just running around in circles in this area right hither ah, detour if you don't play detour and you have it you're missing out on some crazy luck because this map is just you know crazy lucky just randomly you'll hit insane trick shots my best free for all trick shot of all time is on this map if you've seen it you know which one i'm talking about the insane 1080 wall bang moving on though this is the area you want to be in you can watch people come up the staircase come through there you can watch people come through the middle of the map you can come in here here. You can watch people spawn back there and people spawn inside there so you want to watch on the other side of this car and you just come in this central area right here i use uav counter uav then orbital v sat when you get a uav it makes it really easy to sit in those central areas because you know when they're coming if you get an orbital v sat you know gg you find yourself spawning on this side this is where i like to camp you can watch them spawning there you can watch the middle you can watch him spawn literally right there so if you're standing right here come around the corner bam it's also a spawn right down there so you just sit in the middle let them come to you fuck some shit up detour okay so cove is extremely fast paced because the spawns on this map are trash use it to your advantage sit right here there's a spawn right on the other side of this map kill that bitch sometimes people come up through there kill that bitch and there's a spawn right on the other side of this palm tree kill that bitch kill another guy right there literally sit here just walk back and forth through these spawns and just make it so they literally like if you just run in circles they'll constantly spawn like see how i'm doing this you kill a guy right here then the guy behind you spawns over here you kill him then the guy behind you spawns over here you just go in a circle kill everybody else cove is is a really good map for free for all sniping it is extremely fast paced but like i said the spawns are shit especially over here on this side i find myself camping right here watching this spawn there's a spawn right there as well and over here and on the other side of that plane wing and on the other side of the plane over there so you can actually camp right here too watch this area someone will spawn on the other side of this rock run right in front of you someone will spawn right there it's a really good area it's a really good map people sleep on it i feel like some of you watching this video haven't even played rush since you downloaded it okay so rush pretty fast paced you can sit right here in this area watch people coming out of there watch people spawn right there spawn on the other side here you just want to run in this area and constantly be looking around surveying the land and whatnot just remember i'm never looking in one spot for very long i'm constantly moving find yourself over on this spawn and there's a spawn right inside that building there can be a spawn over here so be careful but just constantly be looking around people will come down through there people will come in through there people will spawn back here you know what to do here people same thing you do on every fucking map quick scope some bitches this map dig is literally amazing the side of the map to be on is this side i like to camp right Right here look through here and then look down this hallway but the spot of all spots is right fucking here you can just watch this hallway come through here kill them sometimes I do a jump shot hit a guy through there you're just sitting right here it is such an unstoppable spot and this map is so good for trick shot I never find myself sniping on the other side of the map to be 100% honest with you I'll kill like one or two people and then just immediately run to this spot because it's that good on several nuclears in this spot I know you won't find yourself playing frost but if you do this is the 
spot 2B because you can see three different spawns by just looking in this area. Watch this doorway, come into the middle, kill two people over here. You find yourself on this side, you can watch this hallway and then the spawns right here. You want to watch there, back there, right there. And you also want to come in the middle too. Frost is very, very good for sniping. Trick shotting on the other hand, yeah, you might as well just fucking kill last on this map. You can hit a really sick shot, don't get me wrong. But as soon as like two other people get to 29, yeah, you might as well kill last. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. What is this map? It's fucking pod. Welcome. Yeah, you can camp right here behind this Humvee. There's a spawn right here. Just fucking look right here. Look right here, there's a spawn right on the other side of this wall over there, so you want to watch there, and you want to watch the middle. That spot is really good for sniping. Pod is really good for sniping. It's got some good trick shot spots and some good drop backs as well. I like it more for search and destroy than I do for free for all, but if you come over on this side, you can watch this spawn over here. They can come through in there, spawn on the back of that truck. Then there's a spawn right here, so you want to be watching for it. And you just sit in this spot like you do all the other spots. The last map, finally. An hour later, this video takes forever to record because of starting the game up and over and over again. It's the final countdown. I'm so excited to go to sleep. All right, takeoff is amazing for sniping. If you're in this area, you can watch somebody spawn there. You can watch somebody come up there, up there, up there. Like, there's just so many spots for people to come. You need to just constantly be looking. Then you find yourself over on this side. There's spawn around the other side of that little can right there. There's spawn way back there. There's spawn back there. And then you can watch people there and spawn back there. And you just keep looking, 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 looking. And we are done. That is how to play the Black Ops 2 free-for-all maps. Thank you all so much for taking the time to watch this video. If you watched the entire thing, I need you to smash that like button. I need you to leave a comment saying, I watched the whole thing. I really hope it helps you guys out. I know some people have probably seen it before. If you watched it again just because, then you are the real MVP. And yeah, like I said, hopefully it helps my friends. And as always, I hope you all have yourselves a fantastic day. A farewell, a goodbye, and here comes that motherfucking woo!